guys. Join me in making some yummy cheese wontons. All you need is gyoza wrappers, string cheese, oil to fry it in, and salt. Unwrap your string cheese. I use one string cheese for two wontons. After you have them unwrapped, cut your string cheese into thirds. And then you're going to want to cut some of those thirds in half so that we can just give each wonton just a teeny bit more. I like it to be filled so that there's not a big air pocket when you fry them. Something I like to do to prepare the gyoza wrappers are to gently stretch it out just a little bit. I feel like the dough is pretty thick and I want to thin it out a little just so that it fries a little more quicker and it's not too chewy. Now time to assemble. Have a little cup of water and use it to help seal up the wonton. easy was that. Bring them over to the stove. It's time to fry them. Add about half an inch of oil and set your heat to medium. Also, don't forget to set up a cooling rack. Once your oil is ready, gently add your cheese wontons. sure that you don't fry it on high heat or else it'll burn quickly and the inside will still be doughy and not cooked fully. I fry them for about a minute and a half on each side and then I will quickly remove them out of the oil onto the cooling rack and I will put salt on it right away. I decided to make a bigger batch because my kids love these things. They ask me to make cheese wonton all the time. Thankfully, it's really quick and easy to make. This is something you definitely want to eat while it's still warm so you can get that really nice cheese pool. Enjoy!